Welcome back to BuzzMoncton.com. It's indeed a pleasure to welcome to our uh, our stage, our own little stage here on the internet, uh, Mr. Matt Minglewood, a Canadian legend, a guitar legend from Cape Breton, Nova Scotia, who's in town uh, putting on a show for us tonight. Welcome to Buzz Moncton. Thank you. Hey. You're looking welcome. well. Well, better look good than feel good. <laughs> <laughs> you still play hockey, Matt? We had that conversation. Yes, I do. Uh, three three times a week. Yeah. But not in the last month. My, my shoulders. Uh, but, yeah. so. Hopefully next year. Must be all that shoveling you did over the winter, yeah. Uh, tons of that, too. Yeah, yeah. So you're still on the road quite a bit? Yeah, fair amount. I was thinking the other day, you must have done some travels uh, outside of Canada quite a bit. Where would be your, your favorite destination if you had to go play someplace outside of the country? I've played all, th all through the States since, uh, a few years ago and recorded in New York. And I love New York. Recorded in Memphis. Loved Memphis. Uh, you know, for me, anywhere there's people that enjoy what I'm doing, I'm happy. It doesn't, it doesn't matter where it is. Right on. And you're still getting offers, so that's a good sign. Yeah. Um, tell me about something that's happening in Halifax. Um, probably by the time this airs, it'll already have happened. However, Guitar Fest, this is the first time for this Guitar Fest event. Yeah. How important is that to, uh, to okay. highlight guitar? Well, I think they're going to try and make it a, a, a yearly thing. This is the first one. Hopefully it'll work. It's a three-day thing. They have all guitar seminars and they have uh, gear seminars as far as I know and they've got a great lineup of, of uh, artists like you know Wild T and Lee Cox is coming and uh, from Jimi Hendrix fame and, and others and uh, Pat Travers and a lot of, of, of uh, maritime guitar players so it's going to be fun yeah I'll bet so you're going to be hosting at one of these events oh, I'm hosting the first night I think with the a lot of the uh, the guys I know, you know, stuff from around the Maritimes. It's going to be fun. Yeah, We're yeah. going to do that big jam in the end, and, and uh, it'll be fun. Now, See all, all the boys and girls again. You had a reunion with Sam Moon. Was that last year? Or is it coming up this year? I, don't, I remember seeing something about that. No, we, d we did a few shows. We played the Music Nova Scotia Week in Truro, and that uh, was our first one. We did a, a big one in PEI, and we got a couple more coming up. We got one actually... I think we're going to do one at Parley Beach here this summer. So, and uh, yeah, it's good fun. Like Sam and I started together, like on the road, and and so we kind of revisit. We do some present Minglewood band stuff. We do some present Sam Moon stuff, and we revisit some of the old things that we did way back when. Always fun. Yeah, oh, it's great. It was great fun. We had a great time doing it. Do you do any? Well, I imagine you still do writing. You do must yep. do, still write. Still writing. Yep. Yeah process as uh, fluid as ever? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> it's, it's slower than it used to be. The, the, the pressure is not there to write anymore. You know, like In the old days, we'd do a, a rec record and uh, you'd go out on the road and play for a year and uh, and then all of a sudden the record company wants you to, well, here's up, you need another one. Yeah. Well, excuse me, <laughs> we've been on the road for a year. So you had pressure to write and uh, get it done. So, but that pressure's not there anymore. So I don't have a record company and doing it all by all our, ourselves. So, okay, take my time with it. Yeah. So when you when you write and you perform like to yourself like that, are you taking advantage of the technologies of the day, or is that something that? No, absolutely. I have a little, you know, like everybody now. I, I have a little studio in the house, and it really helps. Uh, you know, just. Uh, get your stuff down and try different things you know by yourself you have all the time in the world to, to try different things it's amazing what they have nowadays things you can do I'm not into pro tools or anything yet I'll try it but I just want it for getting ideas it works great we could sit and chat all day I know you have some important things to do here before the night uh, before the night begins um, I just want to just one more question you've done so much in your in your professional career um, is there anything left on your list of things to do? Uh, you know what? I, I, I don't think I'd... Any Hollywood dreams? Of, no, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> Writing an autobiography? I'm a bad or... actor, trust me. <laughs> you know, so, uh, no, I don't have any aspirations to doing that. I just want to play music and, and as long as people are enjoying it and coming out. And I want to do, uh, I will do another uh, recording project at some point. Mm -hmm. I don't know what you call them now. Like, um, I, I'm on eight track. Well, they're <laughs> extinct. And cassettes, <laughs> LPs are extinct. CDs are going to be out the window soon. It's all digital now. So I don't know what the next one I'll, I'll do will be called, but I'll do it. And it'll be out there. Yep. It'll be out there. 
Well, have fun tonight, Matt. Thanks well, thank a lot. Thank you. We're going to have fun. And um, we'll Got a lot see of you. cousins and family here tonight. Oh, so. is that right? Oh, yeah. Tons of them. Fantastic. Yeah. For Matt Minglewood, I'm Terry Parker. Thanks a lot for joining us on buzzmoncton.com. Check out our events page and our Buzz Extras page, too, for lots of cool music videos and such. So we'll see you next time. Thanks a lot for checking in. Oh, no, no.